baby. Okay, hi guys. I just got back from the hospital. Today was the first day of me going into the operation room and I wanted to share my experience going in to see a C-section today. Basically a C-section is like a woman is pregnant and she goes under surgery, um, cuts up the belly so that the baby can come out. It's done via surgery. I changed into the scrubs that they gave me, put on some gloves, shoe covers and head cover, and I went into the surgery. It was so cool because it was just like how I saw in the movies, like these lights flashing over to the patient and there were so many people like the scrub nurses, the anesthesiologists, the obstetrician and obviously the patient was there she was lying there but what was interesting is that I'm not sure exactly why but she had her arms out like this it was kind of tied I'm not exactly sure and they had to keep her warm from the chest up but from the chest down she was exposed and she was getting ready for surgery the first thing that I noticed that I thought was surprising is that there isn't a lot of blood and it's not too messy it seemed pretty controlled like there's nothing splashing on the floor there's no like blood like like that maybe the surgeon was really good and the nurses were really good the second thing that i noticed was that when the surgeon cut up the amniotic sac so the baby can come out like a teeny bit of water came out and then all of a sudden like in the blink of an eye the baby just pops out like he pushes or something like that and then the baby comes like rushing out with all the water and it's like done super fast and then i see the baby come out and i was just so fascinated and so touched by it it's like a whole new baby that came out who was born right that second like the baby is not even a day old it's like two minutes old and the baby baby's coming out with the umbilical cord attached and it was just so fascinating and so like amazing to see like someone giving birth yeah and I was really touched by it like I don't know I, I can't express it in words because it was just so so emotional seeing like a person come out and after that the surgeon clamped up the cords like that the umbilical cords like that the surgeon cut it and immediately the baby's taken by the nurse the surgeon has to finish up the surgery so he was doing that and I followed the nurse because I was just so fascinated by this baby she was she was really really beautiful she was small she had a bit of slime on her she had hair she had all 10 fingers and 10 toes and she was crying well and she had this umbilical cord coming out of her which is just so cool and i followed the nurse the nurse put her into this little tiny bed it's the cutest thing the nurse gave her vitamin k injection and hepatitis b vaccine to prevent complications yeah i was just looking at the baby after that the baby opened her eyes and it was just the most adorable thing ever she was so fascinated by what's going on because it's her first time seeing the world she's like what is this and she had these big beautiful eyes i kept looking at her i was like this looking at her this whole time because i was just so fascinated but she didn't look at me because i don't think she could recognize faces yet it was just amazing to witness a moment when a human being first opens her eyes and sees the world and i was there to experience that that's just so amazing and on top of that the cutest thing is that she was given like teeny little white hat to put on her head and she was like kind of put into a burrito position so she can't move and such a cute burrito baby yeah and for like a good solid 10 minutes the baby was put into this little kind of cubicle room thing i for a solid 10 minutes i kept looking at her because it was just so amazing she wasn't crying that much as well she was crying only a little bit when they cut up the cords and when she came out but other than that she was very calm Oh, and after that, I saw the baby taken by the nurse. And so the nurse had this formula that she was trying to feed the baby. And that was also amazing because I'm the first person to ever witness her eating food, which that's so cool. Yeah, so the nurse was holding her like this and I was just amazed. I said, oh my God, she's beautiful. This is so, so amazing. And she agreed with me. When the nurse put the formula feeder into the baby's mouth, the baby was just mesmerized. She was like, oh my God, what is this? Because she's never sucked anything she's never eaten anything before in her life and the nurse was like come on come on you can eat this is food she'll figure it out soon and i was just looking at her and i was encouraging her oh come on this is food it's good stuff you can eat it all of a sudden the baby started suckling and she was like oh this is really good and then she started like continued she continued to eat which is just the cutest thing ever yeah after that i went back and watched sutra of the mother and i'm super glad that i didn't faint because i was worried that there's gonna be so much blood and i'm gonna get a vasovagal reflex and faint but luckily Luckily I didn't. I was trying to breathe in and breathe out and take deep breaths so I don't fade, which was a good thing. And yeah, there's a lot of different types of C-sections and when you would use a certain type of C-section. So I'm definitely going to read up on it today and hopefully next time I can scrub in and help with the surgeon, maybe hold the retractor or maybe help clean up the blood. And yeah, I'm very excited and this has been such an amazing day because I got to witness a person giving birth. Wow. Come here, report to C-section duty. I hope I don't pass out. Yes. <laughs> Are we good? First day of uh, C-section. Wipe the baby. Right, then give the baby to the mother. 
Give her a big thumbs up.